Today we have a game trigger controller from Paseos, but it's not just a trigger like the ones we usually see. This one also includes grips to make it more comfortable to hold. Almost like a PlayStation controller or something similar. The box looks nice and all, but it has some signs of the long journey to my house. Let's just hope the product is well protected inside the box. They are kinda shaped like grenades, which makes sense since they are called grenade handles. It's also written here on the back that they are suitable for phones smaller than 6.5 inches and thickness less than 10 millimeters. Here they are, and of course there are two of them. Nicely packed and protected. They actually look very nice. Round like grenades and a nice rubber plate on the inside to prevent the phone from sliding. The trigger on top is made of metal and feels responsive and easy to touch. The top is also adjustable to fit phones of different sizes. Let's put it on my phone and see how it looks. It's a Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus. You can insert the phone from the side or like this from the front. Please also note that I did not take the rubber case off my phone. It's a thin rubber case, but it's still nice to not having to remove it every time I want to play a game. The spring in the adjustable arm is quite strong, so the controller is not going to move by accident. The trigger on the back feels good and springy. It's easy to reach and the placement feels natural. Let's try it this way. Nope, the arm isn't long enough, so that's not gonna work. Let's just do it like this. Both triggers are now in place and it feels quite good. It's comfortable to hold and feels much more stable compared to using only the triggers on top. Having the triggers slightly on the back instead of on the top also makes the angle between the phone and my thumbs better. It feels more natural to hold it like this. Let's start up the game and see how it works during gameplay. Because of the grenade handles on the back, it feels a bit like holding a game controller. And the pinky, ring finger and middle finger are in a more comfortable position than before. It's much more comfortable than holding only the phone with the triggers on top. The triggers are also in a natural place for the index finger, so it's easy to reach and works very well. The best part about using any triggers is that it makes it a lot easier to move around while aiming and shooting at the same time. You don't have to stop to aim or click the trigger on the screen. So let's enjoy some gameplay and if you enjoyed the video consider to subscribe to my channel and maybe comment and like below. There's also some product links below if you want to buy this product. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.